Ukraine says it may face delays in the payment of salaries and pensions for almost 12 million people if the West does not provide financial assistance in early 2024. Here's a summary of the article. Your profile can be used to present content that appears more relevant based on your possible interests, such as by adapting the order in which content is shown to you, so that it is even easier for you to find content that matches your interests. Content presented to you on this service can be based on your content personalization profiles, which can reflect your activity on this or other services, possible interests and personal aspects, such as by adapting the order in which content is shown to you, so that it is even easier for you to find content that matches your interests. Information regarding which content is presented to you and how you interact with it can be used to determine whether the content e.g. reached its intended audience and matched your interests. Reports can be generated based on the combination of data sets regarding your interactions and those of other users with advertising or content to identify common characteristics. Information about your activity on this service, such as your interaction with ads or content, can be very helpful to improve products and services and to build new products and services based on user interactions, the type of audience, etc. Content presented to you on this service can be based on limited data, such as the website or app you are using, your non precise location your device type, or which content you are interacting with. Certain information is used to ensure the technical compatibility of the content or advertising, and to facilitate the transmission of the content or ad to your device. This post received a score of 6,400, with an upvote ratio of 87%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. This is gonna be a hard sell to the American people in a few years. The idea of paying for a foreign nation citizen's retirement check when we barely do it for our own is the exact fuel the Trumpers are looking for. In a few years, this request is a hard sell now. I support Ukraine and even I'm drawing a line here. Yeah, weapons to fight your war, sure. Fully funding your economy, pass. Reminder why aid is blocked. Saying that you need money to pay pensions isn't the way to garner more support. Especially when U.S. is regularly begging Congress for money to pay their own government employees. As a U.S. citizen, I'm all for financially assisting Ukraine to win this war. But, I'm struggling to make ends meet here. Why should Ukrainian citizens get money in their pockets while there are plenty of U.S. citizens who also need it? Have all the bombs and bullets you want though. The money Ukraine would have paid in pensions is instead being used to buy weapons. It's just an accounting trick. But yeah, I agree with you, it's a hard pill to swallow when the income taxes in Ukraine are only 17% plus 1.5% war tax compared to Western Europe where income taxes are like up to 50% and Western Europe is already paying for the economic development of Poland, Hungary and all the newer EU members. Meanwhile in the US, what is a pension? Genuine question. Is a pension better than a matching 401k? As a millennial, when I joined the workforce, only one of my offers after college had a pension. The rest were 401k. The pension company told me that the value of my pension was correlated to how many years I worked for that company. As a 22-year-old who imagined himself moving around jobs or going back to school, the pension sounded worthless to me. Plus as a millennial, I grew up when so many notable pensions went belly up and screwed employees. Pensions were never anything I put any value on. My uncle's side keeps telling me I don't want a pension. He retired from Miller Brewing and he's living comfortably. But if you can manage your money better a 401k is better. They're frugal. Yes. Long story short. As a young person, compound interest is your best friend. Contribute what you can. If it's matched that's fantastic. It's more in your control with a 401k. I'm sure there are some companies with amazing pension programs but those are likely mostly long gone. Crazy thing is that jobs that have a pension still have a 401k. Why should we be paying for another country's pensions when we don't even have pensions in our country? This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.